Oh, he does ping that they must have seen him. A little, little bit of a power. scuffle down in the bottom lane for the first time. This is not according to the regular Dota 2 script. So Antares is going to end up getting whacked away. And it's going to be the first blood. It's like they're trying to let Stormstormer get it, but Kathomi will get the final hit. That's so funny. He was walking towards the Roche pit, and they were like, oh, don't let him deny to Roche. All right, level five on Stormstormer, level five on Kiyotaka. Stormstormer just a little bit further ahead here in terms of that experience, but I'm sure we see something start happening soon. Top lane, though, solo. Turns back around. They get the kill on Kathomi, and this TP wants to punish Gabby here from the charge. Grenade, too? Yeah, there it is. Oh, no, he is soaring, and then the blood grenade immediately ticked him to death. Feels Not bad. gonna be able to use his Q even. I believe Cell is still alive after all this. Rune. Looking at lightning now, do you feel like Entity has put the pressure on more? Um, I, I think they are a little bit reactive to what's happening here right. more so. But they're going mid with ulti. They're going mid with the ulti, and they can see those teleports are coming out as Kata Omi taking a lot of damage. They want Kiyotaka. They need to bounce around a little bit more. One more hit there, and his Fishman will finish him off. So low sitting very low too, so a swashbuckle will be just enough to get the kill. And Antares is just going to back off here while top lane Gabby continues to try to put the pressure over onto Ramses, but he cancels out that Starbreaker easily as bottom lane, Watson and Miera will trade. Oh boy, that's a good trade though for the Snark. Gets Ooh, oh the my kill god, first. Antares? And similarly, mid lane, I mean, getting that uh, pango roll before the Arc Warden ulti was big. Mm, there's going to be a charge over to the mid lane, over on to Fishman. He will pop as now Stormstorm, looking to get this Kiyotaka, will be able to manage it. And they'll go and grab that Tempest Double. It's all timeout just before they can land. Uh, it actually died. Just to clear camps, but they have the, the backup if needed. Tech Storm Stormer rolling on in, and there it is. Like we said, the level six is online. Stampede Godbreaker though. joining in, but they don't manage to go and get the kill. Although Antara is still here, is trying to serpentine a little bit. Looks like he will end up dying. Gabby will get rewarded for that early rotation. Uh, that's uh, that's what the Centaur last pick was meant to do there. The Dawnbreaker, you know, has similar saving ability, but they're gonna go on him again here. Oh yeah, they can see Kiyotaka. They've got Kata Omi nearby, so. Uh, it feels very good if you're an Entity fan, and this Tempest will also end up falling, so... Multiples here in this mid lane, but this is... Back down a little bit. They have 30 seconds until the next Dawnbreaker ulti is available. They saw Arcworm walk down mid lane. They have this deep uh, ward on the tier 2, so immediately when they see this, they're just running straight at him. Well, I mean, yeah, that's exactly the play, as while this is happening, there's a hunt on Antares, but... Kata Omi, alright, he's there with Stormstormer, they'll finish off Kiyotaka. And this and chase is still clone. happening, but they'll be able to go and punish Antares for being in the jungle. Oh, maybe Top Sven lead. can come in for a quick kill Solo? here. Ulti. That was close. Over into the mid lane, though. Ramses will be able to clean up. I guess a quick Every kill single there. lane had something going on during that time frame. Thank goodness. <laughs> is this on shutting down a mid laner like this? That, that means that the carry is going to have a free time. And again, Sven hasn't died a single time. A nice block on this camp here. So they've smoked up. So see Kata Omi again. This little ghost walk, so to speak. Watson finds his opening. Oh, a big punch, and Ramses is just dead. Can oh, they go for it? Fast enough. I think it's going to be pretty darn good for them here as they get the hand of God off. Keeps them nice and healthy. Yeah. Meanwhile, the... they want Kiyotaka again, but look at him. He's like, uh uh. Nope. This can really do without ending up like having to bail. And then your other two cores, right? You've got the Sven, you've got Kiyotaka. Kiyotaka's had a really difficult time. He's not going to be able to group up with the rest of the team to be able to make these moves. Yeah, and Watson <laughs> is doing great on the Snark as well. And this well. is the he aggression keeps... we talked about. Again, you know, he can't even get out of here. He's just dead. There's no Stampede now. This is uh, this is really rough for Nine Pandas. They're losing access to everything at the same time. Watson going into the enemy ancients here. He's gonna go for a Sven. Yeah, he sees himself as Ramses. They will have the God Strength up in about five seconds, but he's got the Storm Hammer. They'll jump forward. He's already dead, and Phoenix now has to cancel that TP. And Tari is. is charging in. He might want to cancel this out. There's a Sven near. Or not, sorry, not a Sven. There's a a Chen nearby. 
as they kill Kiyotaka yet again. The chase is on after Antares. Click, click, click. That is a double kill for a very patient Watson. They need to break this pattern right now on Nine Pandas. This is not okay. They need to start making some smoke and doing a wraparound move. They have a ward to seize Miero. They know he's farming for his blink dagger, so they want to try and delay this timing. And they're going to be so happy to see him run left instead of right here, because him going on the small camp, that means he's dead. Yep. Watson's here, lands the pounce, in comes the snowball. No mount left for at all, and there's a big old walrus punch. As Watson finishes him off and Stormster was just like, oh, cool. Like, I'll go check out the rest of the things, guys. Didn't even need me. Still holding on to that Rolling Thunder. He's in a great position currently because there is a Kiyotaka oh, about boy. to walk over. This is like when a cat falls asleep with his paw open and a mouse walks inside. It really is. He's going to see him now and oh. be like, hey, guys, right here. Yeah, and then you have the Dawnbreaker. You don't even need the Dawnbreaker, honestly. But you know what? Now you're in a great position to start putting pressure on the tower. Yeah, and Roche and at the same approach. time. They're, they're doing both at the same time because they feel so free in this game. So normally you don't go for double objective like this at the same time. You, you know, stretch yourself too thin. But Nine Pandas just do not have anything going right now. So they're going to simultaneously be losing Roche and the tier two tower possibly. I mean, it's 11, well, 10k net worth lead currently. But yeah, you know, you're feeling very, very powerful, very strong. Kataomi finds himself on Taris, does not have that charge, so the Walrus Punch with the Rolling Thunder, just coming on through, they'll finish up Hand of God coming in clutch here for Kataomi, as he throws the shards up, Miro still should be able to get this kill. Now Stormstormer a little bit on his own, but look at this, in comes Dawnbreaker, needs to land that Star Breaker, oh, it's so close, but not quite, just chilling. Oh, Miro blink. Miro, they Looking see for him, they spot. saw him earlier. Good spot. Uh, might be enough. Oh, it is enough, it's just enough, but it's not looking great here for Ramses. Stormstormer and Watson already in position as they get a couple of these clicks off. Push over onto Solo, they'll get both of them. Yeah, TPing straight mid as well. They see the Arc Warden and their eyes just light up like, oh, Arc Warden, you say. Very healthy. Don't have the Hand of God any longer. Spend coming in. Can they find this opening? Can they find the position? We'll clear up a bunch of the Chen Creeps. They'll be happy with that. And again, here you go, Miro. He was smoked up. Pounce forward here from Watson. 30 seconds left on this Aegis. They're going to be able to provide a lot of support. The jump in against Stampede. They just rip apart Ramses. Kiyotaka Storm just trying to run away with this t clown here off to the side. Man, that was so nice. They waited long enough with the Tusk jump that when they jumped in, it doesn't matter if you want to BKB anymore Ooh. now, because now you're just dead. Oh god, they're just chasing after Miro. They've already taken care of Solo, Dawnbreaker, Ultimate, landing over onto Miro. They get Kiyotaka, they get Miero. In comes Antares. He wants Kata Omi, but he's got to run. He's got to get out of there. And they call and they GG. They've had enough. They realize we can't bounce back from this, unfortunately, for the side of Pandas. Yeah, this is just completely over already. 21 minutes in, but this, this lineup never really got to take off. This was just a complete shutdown of whatever it was the nine Pandas wanted to do. They didn't hit the timings. They didn't get enough items.